Saturday, 22nd of March 2014, seen 14 of Ireland's colleges descend on Keel Ackle Island at the weekend to compete in the 2014 InterVarsities Championships. And we've uh, myself and Connor here have judged uh, five heats. Competition is good, some good servers out there. Conditions around about maybe you know head high, it's cross offshore. Good conditions, there's good surfable waves coming through. Uh, surfers need to attack the surf today, uh, it's challenging. There's some big sets coming up the back, it's challenging, but some good ways to be had. Some good ways to be had.
day of qualifying heats on Saturday, the competitors and supporters were treated to a guest talk from one of Ireland's leading surfers. Great just to see, was it 188 people or something come down and yeah, get to experience what Ackles like instead of, I don't know, going to their usual spot, so it's great. Bear attention, please. I have a special speaker here tonight, so you all give it up for Fergus Smith? Kind of, especially when, when you're starting out and you really want to, like, I was so determined to, like, surfing, I wanted to be in my life, and you kind of do whatever it takes, and then you do, you kind of do things nearly that you don't really want to do, and I try to always try to stay true to myself, but you're doing things for companies at the end of the day, and then you start getting paid, which is great, but the moment I started getting paid, I realised, you know, I didn't want to be answering to companies, and then I just started doing things for myself. But like I'm not any kind of, you know, gnarly, big, macho, strong dude or anything. It just happens really naturally if you if you're interested in those kind of ways. I don't know, you just over time the more you plug away you'll just learn to kind of figure them out. It doesn't come from you know, anything else, it just comes from your love of actually wanting to ride them. If you really want to ride them, you can kind of find a way of doing it. And then if it's the product of your environment as well, if the ways of the quality in Ireland weren't here, you know, I wouldn't be chasing big waves probably. It's only because they're on my doorstep and you see them and you're kind of like, wow, like, you know, that's the most amazing way I've ever seen it. I mean, like, you could do it on a three-foot wave. Like, I was chatting to Gabe Davies today, and he broke his leg on a two-foot beach break. And thankfully, touch wood, I haven't broke my leg on any big waves. It's like, you know, it can happen, and it's not to worry about it too much, because you'll never do anything, really, otherwise. Jeez, I ain't got many pearls, but um, it's just practice, isn't it? It's pretty much... It's just what follow what you want to do. Like I love surfing, you know, beyond belief, and and I still do. But I was just mad about it, and I did whatever it took. You know, I'd be on buses going here and there and camping, and spend a lot of time in Ackle, but anywhere. Like in if you, wherever you can get, whenever you can get in the sea, you just it's time in the ocean. Even if it's small, big, and different, whatever it is, just get in the water, and it's that time in the water is where you really start to learn. Well, have a great night and weekend. Enjoy Ackle.
Weekend surfing championships drawing to an end, there was only one thing left to do. This year's winners received their prizes in the beautiful Ackle Sun. Yeah, great, deadly. Uh, the waves were great. The sun came out first, thank God. And yeah, I w yeah, deadly. Worked out well. Sunrise time to go. Grab your phone, take some pictures. Love in a modern. Oh, matching shiny shoes, dressed like thriller. 